Welcome to Number Tiles. In this lesson, I'm learning to add by counting on when the larger number is given first. You can see down here I've got two groups of counters. I've got six counters over here, and I've got four counters over here. And I want to work out how many counters I've got in total. So I can record that like this. Six plus four equals something. Now what I'm going to do is turn those six counters upside down. And now we're going to try and solve this question by counting on from the larger number. Well the larger number was six over here. So if that's six, this must be seven, eight, nine, and ten. So six plus four equals ten. Let's try another question. Now here you can see I've got eight counters and over here I've got three counters. I want to find out how much I've got if I put them all together. Well, I can record that like this. Eight plus three equals something. Now just like last time I'm going to turn these counters upside down. And now we're going to solve this question by counting on from the larger number. So we know over here that these were 8. So that must mean that this is 9, 10, and 11. So 8 plus 3 equals 11. Now let's see if we can try one without the counters. Um, let's imagine I've got 7 counters, and I want to add five more counters. So I'm trying to work out how much I have in total. Well just like last time I'm trying to imagine seven counters in my head. So to solve this question I need to count on from the larger number which is seven and I need, I'm going to need to go up five numbers. So the num next number after seven is going to be eight, then nine, then ten, then 11, then 12. And let's just check, the question said I had to go up five numbers, so let's just check that I did do that. I went up 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yes, I did go up the right amount. So the answer is 12. 7 plus 5 equals 12. Let's try another question. Uh, this time I'm a, I've got nine counters and I want to add five more. So in my head I'm imagining nine counters and I know that I'm going to have to move uh, five little jumps forward. So the next number after nine is ten, then is eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. And just like we did last time, let's just check that we did move up five. One, two, three, four, five, yes we were right. So 9 plus 5 must equal 14. Now let's try one last one but a bigger example. This time let's imagine I've got 27 counters and I need to add 6 more. So I'm thinking in my head that I'm going to be starting at 27 and counting up 6 numbers. So I know the next number after 27 is 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. And let's just check that I did move up six numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. So 27 plus 6 equals 33. Well, I hope you've found this lesson helpful. For more help, check out teachertools.co.nz.